Chess is a game of make-believe, kings and queens, pawns and rooks. So what does that have to do with real life? Well, it turns out quite a bit. Here's CBS's Jamie Ukas. It's the most unique piece in the game. For 12 year old Andre, chess is more than just a game. I use a lot of stuff that I've learned on the chessboard in real life, like think before you move, think before I act out. He's just one of thousands of students from some of LA's toughest neighborhoods learning to play. I learned to play chess at age 13. It was a pivotal, pivotal moment in my life. Damon Fletcher grew up in Compton. After going away to college, he came home to find his childhood friends struggling. Some of them had fallen into the prison system, gang life, and drugs. And I just wondered, why did I have such a different outcome? And it was chess. Very good. I'm glad he started so Train of Thought to help kids of all ages find their inner king or queen. Every game of chess is 75 to 100 moves. And every single move that your opponent makes presents a new problem for you to solve. Kids are just having fun. They don't realize that they're solving problems. The answer is always there. How do you teach a five-year-old how to play chess? We actually have a really cool story that we use to help kids that age set up a chess board for the first time. It goes, the king and the queen got married by the bishops. They rode on horses to their castle and had eight children. My main thing in class is be a scholar. So. Being a scholar to me is being prepared, productive, and never giving up. That's the best way to play. Mastering the game of life early. Jamie Ucas, CBS News, Compton.